Hello guys, welcome back to another video. In this video, I wanted to quickly showcase that I was able to package the game animation sample project for a mobile device. For all you guys who haven't played around with the game animation sample project, essentially it uses motion matching to have dynamic animations. There's over 500 plus motion capture animations that are free. So I took this free sample project and added mobile input by adding a simple mobile joystick that moves the character around. Then I added a jump widget button so that the character can use touch input to jump. And then lastly, I added a touch input to move the camera around as you can see here. But yeah, I got the game animation sample project to package for a .apk for Android devices. So here you can see the project running very smoothly on a mobile device. And actually this is the Samsung S10. So I bought this phone off eBay a while ago and I don't actually own any Android devices or actively use them. But before we dive way into the video, I want to quickly tell you about my multiplayer survival game course. I just released a new course on how to make a multiplayer survival game inside of Unreal Engine 5.4. This course covers over how to make a survival game in the latest version of Unreal Engine that features things like an inventory system, harvesting system, different types of weapons and tools, and everything is set up for multi-platform support. So if you want to use input for Xbox or PlayStation, controller or even just keyboard input support there's lots of stuff that we create in this course including a open world map a building system tribe slash clan system and much more the course is currently being remastered and re-recorded in unreal engine 5.4 but you can get access to the original course that is recorded in 5.0 that has over 250 plus lectures and over 70 hours of course content by simply adding it to your cart at checkout so go to my website smartpoly.teachable.com to check out my unreal engine course courses and make sure you pick up the multiplayer survival game course link in the description below and as always without further ado let's get right into the video anyways here's the project loaded up so i have the joystick here on the left so this moves the character in any direction and then to move the camera around i set up a touch input so you just drag anywhere on the right side of the screen and that will move the camera around to look around. And then the only other input that I set up was for jumping, since you need to be able to hit the jump button to vault or climb up any sort of platform. There are still a couple of other types of inputs I'll need to add. For example, things like sprinting and also if they add crouching in the future, I'll need to add a input for that. But it's just as simple as adding another button on the screen. But yeah, I was able to get this package for an Android device. Android is actually a lot easier to package for, at least when you compare it to iOS, at least for installing and sideloading the actual app on the device itself. Since Apple really doesn't allow you to install your own apps on your phone without their permission. Also, here is me testing the other different types of characters. So as you can see here, I loaded up the Echo character here and it's running pretty good on a mobile device. There really isn't any lighting in the scene, uh, like there isn't really any directional light, so there aren't any shadows. But other than that, it looks pretty good. Also, you shouldn't have much issues if you are using any of the characters in the animation sample pack on a mobile platform because you can just get away with these scalability settings. All you have to do really is set the project target hardware to mobile and the engine can essentially do the rest. But yeah, it looks pretty good since all of the cloth physics and everything is working nicely on a mobile device. And also it's running at a good frame rate. Like it's definitely not laggy in any way. Although there is a little bit of flickering in the background. I'm not sure exactly why. Anyways, I'm interested to see what you guys think about this down in the comments down below. I did the exact same thing when Epic Games released another free template, uh, the crop out sample project about last year. So if you guys want to watch a video about that specifically, I'll leave a link to that in the description below. But yeah, let me know what you guys think about this down in the comments down below. If you want to see a tutorial on how to package this game for mobile devices, I'm really trying to figure out how to integrate this sample project to create any sort of game. Really, all I can think about is creating some sort of parkour game, maybe a climbing game like Only Up or Chain Together. Let me know what you guys think down below and also check out my multiplayer survival game course on my website, smartpoly.teachable.com. And yeah, as always, I'll see you guys in the next video.